been a while. I know I haven't vlogged in a while on my videos. I did just upload my um, Trader Joe's haul though, but it was my day off today and did nothing but uh, yard work. But let me show you guys what we've been up to. Haven't been focused on YouTube because we have been busy like trying to figure out what we're gonna do in, in our yard. So first things first is <clears throat> we have new babies. So this is not where the chicken coop is gonna be. It's just, it's just where this is at for now. But um, that is Danica's baby. This is BB. They're about like we've had them for about two weeks, I think. And the black one, I forgot. I think the black one is Boba, and the brown one is Danny's. I forgot what Danny called the um, called her brown brown one. Jonathan's is one of the speckled ones. And then just in case I lose one, I have one extra. Oh, and Java. Well, Java's really good with the with the with the babies. He doesn't bark at them, but he does like to mess with them. Of course, like any other older older brothers to their sisters, right? So we just let him be. He's having fun with them. Um, the chickens kind of feel scared sometimes, but I think he's just being playful. Danny had her birthday party. Yes, my love. She is now 11. Oh, what is that? A bug? Okay, just throw it there. Wow, good job, yeah. And Danica. Danica's growing. She's about to graduate her pre-K. Hubby bought this at Costco, and it's the worst investment ever because once you fill it up with water, and over here it gets hot for like a day, the next day it may not be hot. So then, whatever water you put in there for that day then it gets basically wasted and this is exactly what happened when when we had that one hot day and he decided to fill this up that's why i like the little five dollar pool better um just for danica but at least he went in there i think danielle went in there with danica when it was um when it was the first day i think this is like the second week that water is what i'm using to water my plant so i just get a bucket because I, I feel so bad. It's just so much water wasted. But what we're going to do, so for Mother's Day, I wanted a rototiller. So I went ahead and rototilled that side. And this is why I haven't been making videos. So I figured I'd go ahead and give you guys a vlog update of our life here. So we've, I got four kids and then I got five more. So now I got nine kids. I've got nine babies that I'm taking care of. But hubby has been really good taking care of the baby chicklies. Hi, babe. What's up? You've been taking care of the baby chicklies. Oh, my baby chickadees. That's his baby. So the kids wanted the, the baby chicka, chickies, but he's the one that's really been taking care of them. So um, right now they are in, our, in my studio. And this is just their like bed from last night. Because um, we take them out here like before noon, maybe 10 o'clock when it starts getting warm. They play out. And then hubby cleans out or i clean out every night um when they go in we got a hammock for that tree and then another side just so much like we have so much yard we we can only focus on our yard like during the late spring and then summertime because you guys know it's so cold here during the winter um but i went ahead and rototillered this area i want to plant my um my azaleas this is the studio this is where they're um they're currently living and then i want to plant my azaleas here we're gonna put a fence around here and then what we're building right now is a um i bought some um like fencing for my beans because danica loves to to grow beans so we're gonna also have another one here and i don't know if i'm gonna use that for veggies or kind of like um uh like flowering pat, um, plants on the other side of my fence it's nothing but wild blackberries. So blackberries here are so wild that they're worse than weeds. They're, they're growing everywhere. I had plants there that I bought from Costco that I planted like, um, uh, like hostas from like bulbs, but it, it never really sprouted because one, I realized this, but my boys had been mowing over those areas and every time the plant sprouted up, they would just mow over it thinking that it was a weed. Oh, he said, sorry. They've been doing this for two years. Like I've been waiting. I'm like, why is it that nothing is sprouting? 
and then all of a sudden I saw one one day I saw something sprout and I was taking care of it I was weeding around it I was watering it and then I came back a couple weekends later and I'm like where are my hostas and then hubby was like oh I had Jonathan mow over it I'm like really so that's what's going on there but I'm gonna redo that and then just plant all these, these things, things are from Costco that I s got from bulbs oh okay so hubby oh sorry I should <laughs> I was just having them caught up. All right, so we are building a raised bed, and yes, I don't know if this is pressured wood. I don't know. I, I think it's, I'm assuming it's pressure wood. It's what, oh, it's not? Because it's fencing, right? So it's not pressured? Okay, so no matter what, I'm still gonna put a plastic liner in there because I am gonna use it to plant like the beans. Um, I'm gonna put a plastic liner like I did over here. I have a plastic liner inside um, so that the, um, um, if it was pressured, then I don't want any um, materials going into the, the soil. So I do have double plastics in there. Um, like, I think they're like pool plastic. So they're very, um, not water, you can, you know, water can't seep through there. I think that's why sometimes I kill off the plants here. But anywho, um, here's the section that we build. We're just using scrap wood that I have in the garage. I'm not purchasing any material um and then we're gonna basically have it here so that the beans because danica loves to grow the beans and then so i'm gonna have two of them here and then i'm gonna have the panel going like that um the wiring or the yeah one of these not this one but you know the the galvanized material so that the girls and i can go underneath it and pick the beans from the um the shaded uh trellis that we're creating okay these are all my plants so this was cutting yes love um she's having fun so our life is chaos our our house is a fixer upper there's always something that needs to be done so these are all being plant um danica planted the beans in here and the peppers and she actually put the seeds in there and i just make sure to water it these are cuttings from a wisteria and look how it's growing so i need um i'm gonna have hubby build me one of those ones for my neighbor and then these are all my dahlias and my um what is the peonies peonies yeah as you guys can see there there's bulbs in there so basically i couldn't put them into the ground because let me show you my my soil so my soil is very clay very clay like it's just clay and rocks and it's so hard it took hubby and i just to dig that one and that one close to one hour so this one i rototilled and then i just got some of these and just basically cover it because we still had some rain so that um so it doesn't um the grass doesn't grow <laughs> so i'm gonna rototill this while he's building that i figured i'd you know get you guys and show you guys because i have not i have not been um making videos and this is why it's because i work i work full time now and although i work from home it just takes up so much of my days like today's my day off and it's running around groceries running around to see lola which is my mom and then running around to do um, dentist appointments and all that stuff so here's hubby Hubby still looks the same. Yes, baby? The what? Oh, Java? You want a cannonball in the pool? No. Java? You want to put... Why don't you go pick up Java and, and give him a bath? Wait, how did this ball get in the pool? I don't know. Did you throw it in there? No. Maybe, maybe someone else threw it. Maybe one Maybe who? Was that someone else named Danica? <laughs> Sometimes she tells little fibs. <laughs> Such a dirty pool. Yeah, so we're gonna um, clean this out. Yeah. Clean that out, and then you know it's summer, so we've taken some uh, vacation time, a couple trips to Disneyland. Good job! Disneyland, uh, Portland. We love to go to Portland. That's where we go to like the Nike employee store, the Adidas to um, get some summer gears for the kids. So we went there a few times. Uh, spent Mother's Day there. 
and this one is from the rototiller over there so yeah so i got oh here i'm also gonna grow grapes over here so i bought an extra one of those um galvanized things that i'm gonna use there so that i can plant um the grapes so the grapes is gonna go from here and then the other one there and then it's just gonna have like a wire um for them to go across and then this is the hula hula berry it tastes like um it tastes like pineapple this is danica's and i think she has yep she has one right there yeah and then these are just the regular strawberries it's it, it's growing she loves to um take care of her berries these are clematis another tomatoes and then this is a zucchini squash and this is why i need to have this done is because these are climbing and that's why i really wanted that is it cold it's dirty water lovely yeah. hubby is just busy again all these boards were just in the garage because i was using them to make signs and then i i stopped making the signs <laughs> all right so i'm gonna go ahead and help him maybe roto tiller that that area and then take you guys along with us uh, later on to show you some uh, hopefully some updates This was hard to this was hard to purchase at the store by myself first of all while hubby was at home relaxing <laughs> what i'm sorry i'm watching my chickens they were about to go inside the chicken coop for the first time oh. i was getting excited oh inside the thing inside the actual okay house. so see how the arch is we're gonna have a raised bed on each side like where he's standing and then we're gonna have another one over there which is this one um elongated like that and then I'm gonna it's basically like this facing like that two of them and then I'm gonna have squash and beans so that the girls see how I'm under it this is about what six feet because I'm five four yeah. five seven about like five, the highest six point yeah, about six, foot. six foot at the highest point so then they can easily just walk in and then once this fills up with uh, beans then it's going to shade it and then they can just pick the beans from the inside that's my vision what do you think babe huh? oh yes it'll look awesome it'll look wonderful. all right so we're just trying to figure out where the arch would be so that i can i can rototill but no matter what i need to rototill the whole anyways because then the walkway is not going to be grass or are you going to mow it that's the question between? yeah where i'm walking just go ahead and oh we can just Let's go ahead and grass grass? Let's grass for now you can always do something with it later but. okay all righty we're gonna go finish that off all right friends we're just cleaning up because we're in the middle of it one of the children actually two of our children uh one needed to be picked up oh danielle is a licensed driver now um but i still have her just drive with a adult uh, or Jonathan in the car. I don't let her drive by herself, even though um, she actually just got her license. I think it was last weekend or two weekends ago. But <clears throat> let me sh go ahead and show you Danica's little raised bed. We made this about two years ago, just from pallet. Um, see how it's bulging out. That's why um, for this one, I told Jacob to have one in the middle or at least just another two um, excess um, extra wood so that it doesn't bulge out. But um, these are beans that she actually planted uh, from the dollar. This is the, the wrapper for it. Um, the dollar store has like four packs of um, beans. Sorry, my allergies. Um, this one is the long beans, I think. This is the, is it? 
long beans it looks like long beans long string beans and, uh, my allergies just got um getting bad today because of um there's a lot of white fluff fluff floating around and i heard it was the dogwood so i get really bad allergies from that but um she started with seed she actually gets the seed and then she puts it into the little pots that i have um available with um soil that prep up and then i think she usually sometimes she puts two or three on just one container so they kind of clump up together but i ended up giving lola some and these ones were the ones from costco i grew really fast and we've only had them for about two i think two weeks what i do is that um when it's pretty high up like this one i just kind of take that out and then um just toss that so that um the energy is more focused on these rather than on the the one that's trying to start up but yeah so um we're running out of time i work tomorrow so um today was my day off but uh we won't be able to work on this for the the weekend because hubby hubby has military and so it's just you know whenever we can let's go see how the baby chickies are doing Whew. this is our cherry tree i think they're rainier cherries we get a whole bunch of cherries but they're so high up that only the birds really um kind of make use out of them we can see how how high it is and no one wants to climb it but yeah this is the rainier cherries and then there's the chickies oh baby chickies so let me see if they'll let me sometimes we just let him walk around the yard too when Jala's not here and he's actually inside see? Why do you have a drum set? I play with my baby. Yeah? Oh, yeah? And I got a picnic. Oh, you're gonna make a picnic. She changed her clothes and <laughs> she got wet. Oh, I know. I'll buy your own. Baby. She's playing mommy to the baby. pretty nice um day out though it's like what time is it like 8 30 8 30 it doesn't um get dark now until about 9 30 over here's another cherry tree i planted because only because um you need as as soon as i planted another cherry tree that um as soon as i planted another cherry tree that cherry tree actually um produced a lot more fruit this one's an asian pear so during the summer um it falls into my yard or um, i'm able to pick on this side so i get some of that this is what we make the lay with when we have a hueke for hula so it's growing pretty good but yeah you just gather these up and you make lays out of them so i have three i bought three more in the front yard this is my magnolia it's growing but i think i need to prune it so that it starts um, becoming like more of a tree not just a bush but see how, how it's gonna be pretty i like it so that's the size of the arch that we're gonna make it and then there's the raised bed we're gonna have another one right here so i told hubby that over here is where i'm gonna plant the beans and then over here is where i can plant like tomatoes uh tomato vines so then it has um, enough room to be able to have tomato cages so that's pretty cool oh clematis so when hubby and i planted this 
<laughs> when it's wet, so sticky. Uh, look at that, it's not pretty. This is, um, I have, it's not pretty, look at that. I have a blue one and then a purple one and then this is my pink one. This is just Costco. When Costco has those bulbs, um, I buy them when they're clearance. I think I bought two more bags of clematis or just one bag of clematis and then they had four of four bulbs in there and I bought it for seven dollars um, and this is where I start off my little seedlings this is peppers from the 99 cents or the dollar there's Danielle Daniela come over here come here she's my Daniela my little big girl oh look baby baby um Tell them to. I'm vlogging again. Oh, wait. Put, put me out. <laughs> so um, she has her, like she even put a, what do you call that? A henna. A henna on her leg. Days ago, like seven days ago. Yeah. It's and amazing. then she got her license. Now she's a licensed driver. Did you drive home? No. You forgot your license? No, well, I had it, but you I didn't don't like driving the, I don't like driving your car. Oh, yeah, my truck. She can't reach she the pedals. SUV. So I'm gonna, um, I bought more seeds. There's Jonathan. Um, I bought more seeds and then I'm gonna, cause I, I planted some on Danica's um, raised bed. I'm gonna plant some more so that when we're done with that, then they'll be all prepped up and ready. But all these are just from um, Costco bulbs. So I planted them two years ago and look, they're all peonies. These are all peonies and those are dahl dahlias. And oh, this is a blackberry, wild blackberry, but I think I'm gonna keep it and then put in a pot like that and um, see if I can just grow my own blackberries because those are wild blackberries I don't eat those but if it's grown under my control I'll eat it and yeah and then these are squash so I'm really needing that for the squash and then here's my peony ready almost ready to open up all right I'm gonna clean up all right friends hubby our first vlog of the season. Ooh. Hey. <laughs> so, back. oh my gosh, Danica, that's dirty water. That has fungus and algae. <laughs> yeah, hubby said welcome back. All right, friends, we're going to see you later. Until next video. There's Java. Come here, baby. Hi, Java. Java. That's be, um, hubby's other baby. He, Java hasn't been getting much attention because of the chickies. Sorry, buddy. Oh, he got a hurt leg. Oh yeah, he's old. How old is Java? He is nine now. Yeah. Java doesn't like to be messed with. He wants to be left alone. Child! That's dirty water, okay? It's okay, you're gonna take a bath. Alright, we're gonna end it. Mahalo friends, till next time.